my beautiful friends welcome back to my channel this is Sabina here and today I'm very excited to do this video as you see my face that um, I don't have any makeup the reason is that I'm gonna do a little bit uh, get ready with me video and this is my first time I'm doing this video and as you know that I'm new in this YouTube world so I'm still nervous and learning a lot of things so if I do some things, mistakes, or my voice goes small or big, just please bear with me and stick with me. And like, it's just like a job experience, you know, I'm learning every day and still I'm very nervous. I don't know why, there is nobody around here, but I'm still nervous just talking in front of camera. Well, it is what it is, but I am really enjoying doing videos too. So today we are invited by Dior and this is a very special event. The event is called Dior um, Lady Art 3, a painted Lady Dior bag. And this is a very special event and I am super excited to be, the, be a part of that event and to see all the art in that Lady Dior and I'm super, super, super excited. So I, I just got back from work, I need to get ready so let's get started and I told you that I don't know i'm not like really good into makeup or things but i will try to do what i can do and um let me bring my mirror it's so bright here and when i put my mirror and it makes more brighter so i don't know what to do like i don't know how other youtubers do that like this is my mirror let me sit right this okay i already put my cream and my sunscreen and everything so I just need to put it found I have to put this foundation and you know that I told you in my other video that how much I love this um, Dior forever foundation so I'm gonna use this one this one is number 40 if you heard the hair dryer sound that is my husband he's getting ready to so we both are going to an event weather today is like really really not good here in Dallas I live in Dallas it's so crazy like um, some days like it's so hot like in winter it's like a 61 it feel like spring and like today it's like so cold outside I'm thinking to wear my jador sling back suits but I don't know because it's so wet outside and cloudy and oh, I don't know what to wear I hate this weather I don't like rain. Today I'm doing a little bit of vlog. My um, essay told me that I can bring my camera and I can, I will take a pictures, if I can, I'll take pictures of um, those Dior bags and I'll show you and I can't wait to show you. Like I'm super excited for doing it. quality and also the people are so friendly there I don't have any special way to do any makeup. I should wear red lipstick, right? And 
and I have the smallest lips ever like I hate my lips so I'm gonna set my makeup with this MAC um, pre prime get ready and I will tell my husband to take pictures of me that what um, I wear and I will also try to take some pictures while I am in your store if I can I but I don't want to be like you know in front of people and taking my camera and taking pictures but if I can then I will try to take all the pictures of those beautiful bags I am super excited I'm, I can't wait for the event it's five o'clock right now here in Dallas and the event is start at six o'clock so I need to go get ready change my outfit and I will see you in so I decided to wear this um, sweater dress it's really cold outside um, and I popped this my Lady Dingo bag since I'm going to the Lady Dingo event so I have to have this bag and I just wear this my for leather jacket and my stew what with my knee high boots i was thinking to wear dior shoes but it's just so wet outside and i don't want to wear any other shoes so this is my we are here in the Holland park um going to that event and it's just so my face is so red because there is a like car in front of me and the heating the brake lights so right here like it's just so nasty weather raining and wet and cold so also a little bit in the back how it looks there see it right like this so dark already here but I'm glad that it's Friday so all the stores right here most of the high-end stores are right around here they're in front of these like pharmacies right there and uh, if you go over there there's the Fendi and next to Fendi is the Dior right there so yeah I'll try to take some pictures inside and see you in a little bit it's my first time vlogging so I told you that I'm nervous I don't know why okay I'll see you in a little bit David Velasco, who's the, the editor for Art Forum, and um, he writes, the muse is the metier for McLean Thomas, the Odalise her great subject. Thomas's painting depicting her late mother Sandra or her lover like Raquel spin her relations into dazzling reflections on how we look and touch, who we see, what we desire. 
rhinestones and glitter and flock and enamel tessellate into marvelous figures. Somehow the fracture does not look broken, but like a coming together. That's great. So beautiful. That's and beautiful. gorgeous. <laughs> Yeah. It touches on one of the first things I'd like to ask you about, which is um, figuration and inspiration. Mm -hmm. So who is coming into your work, and how do you draw from them? How are you yeah. collaborating? Yeah. Well, first of all, thanks for being here, everyone. I'm very excited and honored to you know, do this Dior lady. Dior Arts launch. It's been a whirlwind from Miami to New York to here, you know, and to uh, talk about the inspiration, to to talk, speak about the figuration, the figurative part of my art. Um, I guess it would mostly be the women in my world, the women in my life, starting with my mother, you know, always, and I probably I think even before that, starting with my grandmothers have always, women have always been a huge part of my life matriarchally and also just inspiring me uh, and teaching me how to to be strong and, and and to endure and to be creative and to be, you know, stylish and, you know, all, all of the things that you learn and you look to and, you know, the women in your life. And so I think one thing that I do is look at that, look at my personal life, look at the women in my world, and pull from that for inspiration, and think about some of the images that I want to see out there um, to inspire and to celebrate. It's always about celebration for me. Such a tactility to the work. Yes, mm -hmm. something that a quote brings about this intention to surface, to fabric, to mm -hmm. pattern, to the rhinestone, to Bags and yeah, and I'm wondering how touch is important. Oh, touch is very important. I think, and specifically with thinking about if we want to just speak about what's in front of us and here today is the lady in your bag, and that was one of the main components I was considering. The bag being a work of art or a painting that one could carry through the world with them, right? Because you're always thinking about art and its location, its proximity, our space, the white cube, right? And it's there's always these rules and barriers to how one experience art. You know, you can see, look, but don't touch. And so this opportunity to collaborate with your, for me, was a great opportunity to have a work of art that people can actually touch. Yeah. You know, um, because my work. Um, mostly like my installation and paintings, there's this desire to want to touch because there's the materiality is so tactile, right? Mm -hmm. um, there's this visceral quality to the work that really incite the, that sort of emotion to want to touch something. So having this bag be something that you can really now fill the rhinestones and fill the beads and fill all of the secrets that sort of nature of tac tactile, you know, I think to me touch is very important. And so it was really uh, exciting to finally have a work of art that people can touch, <laughs> you know, yeah. that, they could, that, that they could sort of bring in the world and sort of just, it's, it's a painting on the bag, right? Yeah. And, and that's what I want. I wanted one of my paintings um, to be a part of the bag. Having so much fun here, and oh my goodness, the bags are awesome, awesome. And I got something. I can't wait to show you guys. I'm talking very, in a very what is that called? Baby? Quietly. Quietly, yes, because there are so many people. So with the event, and it was really, really nice, and we met a lot of nice people. And I bought something here, and it's on my back. Sit there. I will. Do unboxing video and now we're gonna go to eat dinner it's dark rainy it's all wet oh i don't know what we're gonna eat what are we gonna eat baby mm, chipotle, chipotle. <laughs> <laughs> he wanted chipotle. no it's a friday night we need to go somewhere uh, 
I don't have a clue. Oh, you guys have never seen my husband, right? Okay, here he is. Uh, you can't see me in the dark. Hey, baby. Say hi to my friends. I'm Batman. <laughs> Why you are a Batman? Because I'm in the dark. You can't see me. <laughs> Might as well get uh, a little closer. We're pretty far out. Okay. Well, so I will tell you all about the bags when I get home. Okay. I'll see you in a little bit. I'm back home from the event, and then the event was so much fun and oh my goodness there are so many beautiful lady dior bags and then those art on the bags was was just amazing amazing and one bag that bag was all made with gold and it's like a 24 karat gold real gold and all those lady dior charms was 24 karat gold i'll insert all the pictures i managed to take a lot of uh, pictures and uh, also, I did a little bit of like, you know, videos and things like that and then get managed to capture a little bit of interview of art of, of the artist. So I will insert all the clip there. I'm so tired now. Oh my goodness, I can't even talk. So it was a really fun event and we met uh, some nice people and I had fun and my husband had fun. And then I bought something. I am so excited. I am super, 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 super excited that I got from Dior, but I'm gonna do an um, unboxing video in my another video so yeah uh, we had really fun time and it was a really I love like you know art and those artists they are so talented and this event is like in only in 10 uh, Dior boutique and around the world only in 10 boutiques and one of that is in Dallas I think New York Miami in United States I think so and rest of those um, another seven is in different countries so yeah I, I felt so happy and privileged to be a part of that event and to see all that beautiful collective bags and yeah I guess yeah I'm just tired I drank one glass of like a champagne and one cocktail and I'm kind of like, oh, my eyes like are red and I'm, I can't even talk. So, yes, that's what about today's event and I, oh yeah, if you have not subscribed, I don't know did I tell that in the beginning or no, if you have not subscribed my channel, please do that and I would love to have you in, have to follow me and subscribe me and like for this video and we can be friend here i will have so many fun videos coming i i've already planned so many fun content for coming like you know week and next week and today is friday here and um i'm ready for tomorrow tomorrow i'm gonna go to hang out with my girlfriends in the evening i'm looking forward for that too and um i guess sunday i'll just hang out with my husband and have a brunch and then Monday go back to work. Yeah, that's the life I guess, right? That's all for today's video. I will insert all the pictures of those bags and you gonna love it. And I can't wait to share that thing because I just feel like those are the beautiful, beautiful bags. Oh yeah, I forgot to tell you, one bag was literally made with rock. Oh my gosh. I don't think so you can carry that bag. I guess you have to put that like, you know, in a showcase, just like that. But it was so cool, like, you know, how they make all those bags and people are so smart and talented. And I really admire those kind of people. So that's all for today. And I'm gonna go to take my makeup off now and I guess go to bed. I'm a little tired and I had a fun evening. I will see you in my next video and just have a good weekend, be happy, be positive, and just smile. Life is too short. We need to enjoy our life. So that's what I think and I try to be positive. So I love you guys and please do subscribe and follow me on my Instagram, Sabina Stone. And I'll see you in my next video. I love you. Good night.